Hello, hello, hello. Uh, welcome to Rock and Locals. Uh, this this is something completely different. Uh, this is for my musical my music people out here. So if you're not really into music, then shut this off. Uh, specifically, the band Metallica. Um, this Friday they are having their uh, SNM Part Two um, in San Francisco. I guess I'm not going. Um, so basically what I wanted to do is I wanted to make a, a prediction video of what I think they're going to play. A lot of it's just kind of guesswork. I have no basis. Um, some of it is songs that they're recently playing in concert that they haven't played in a very long time. Some of it, honestly, is I went on Reddit and I saw what people said. I'm like, okay, that makes sense. And then some of it is just is literally like this song, this song, this song for no reason at all. Or maybe part of me hopes that they play it. Again, this isn't what I want. This is kind of what I'm thinking and whatever. Uh, some of them I'm going to explain because, you know, whatever. Um, so first and foremost, and this isn't the order of the set list, by the way. This is just like, bleh. Um, so I think absolutely they're going to do Ecstasy of Gold. Uh, I think it would be very off-brand of Metallica. If they didn't do it, especially because they have the symphony to do it with. So, uh, Call of Cthulhu, just because uh, recently they've been playing that, I guess. Or they played it more recently than usual, I guess. I, I haven't seen. Um, so, yeah, Call of Cthulhu. Um, I'm also crossing my fingers that this isn't a rehash of SM, because that would be very upsetting. Uh, Outlaw Torn, uh, again, a friend of mine showed me a video, which was amazing. Thank you, Mike. Uh, uh, it was amazing, and I think that's another one. You know, I think they're kind of just greasing up the hinges, I guess, to, to make sure they're able to play these songs and everything goes well. So I think Outlaw Torn is going to be on there. Uh, sad but true, just because I, I think Jave loves asking the audience, do you want heavy? Metallic is going to give you heavy, then do say it true. The past, like, three concerts I've been to, that's always been like a staple. It's almost like a song you're always going to play. So, say it true. Um, Master of Puppets, just because, again, that's, that's a big hit of theirs. You know, a lot of people, you know, it's one of those songs that they can't not play, I guess. Uh, one, I think one is the song that they can't not play. I think the crowd won't leave until one is played. So again, I think that is definitely on there. Um, and then we got, uh, again, this is this is kind of a weird one, I guess, but Halo on Fire. I just, I listened to Halo on Fire the other day. I, I could just hear a symphony behind it. Um, I, so I guess that's that one. Um, hardwired again. I, I just hear you know, you know, very fast violins when it's you know the, 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 all that. That was a terrible impersonation of that song. Uh, now that we're dead, I just spat all over the place. Now that we're dead, um, mostly because when they do it live, they have their whole their whole drum off. So I think it would be, in my opinion, a missed opportunity. If they have a whole percu percussion section and they don't do Now That We're Dead. So I think that's going to be a big one. It would surprise me if that was the best song of the night. Because I think there's a lot they can do with it. Um, Enter Sandman, again, for the past however many concerts I've been to. That's always the last song before the encore. So I think, you know, Enter Sandman. Oh man, I, th I just thought of one. I'll tell you later. <laughs> Uh, nothing Else Matters, again, I think, you know, maybe I'll get in trouble for this, I think Nothing Else Matters was probably one of the better s and songs, it just went very well and it made sense, um, and it's actually, you know, they use the, uh, I think it's Apocalypta, at the end of every concert they use that, so I think, again, that would be weird if they didn't do that. Um, another song that they've been playing recently is No Leaf Clover, and again, no Leaf Clover originated from the first s &M, so I think it's it's either going to be No Leaf Clover or Minus Human. Um, I don't think it's going to be both. I think Minus Human isn't as popular as No Leaf Clover, which I love Minus Human, to be honest with you. Uh, I think they're going to do 
one or two new songs. That would be cool. Again, just a prediction. I feel like, again, it would be a little bit of a missed opportunity. It's been all over the place. Uh, it would be a little bit of a missed opportunity if they had this whole thing and nothing new was played. Um, okay, here's where I get screamed at. Frantic. Um, again, they've been playing a lot of St. Anger recently. They've, they've done the acoustic All Within My Hands. Uh, they've done Frantic recently. So I think that's up there. Um, Atlas Rise, I just hear that's a song with like blasting trumpets and you know, I, I just, you know, it's it's very, um, it just sounds very epic, I guess. You know, the name and just, I, again, I just hear, you know, a lot of wind instruments. Again, I'm not a composer or anything, so I'm just kind of making nonsense. Um, Dream No More, again, I, I kind of get a the thing that should not be vibe. And again, I think that's a very, it would go very well with the symphony. Um... This was, I have to be honest, this I just took straight up from Reddit. This was somebody's uh, prediction. Uh, Unforgiven 3, I guess mostly because of the intro. Um, and again, I've heard they played that very recently. Uh, so yeah, Unforgiven 3. Uh, the Day That Never Comes. Um, I feel like that would be their Hero of the Day song. I don't see them doing Hero of the Day. I mean, again, I'm just, whatever. Uh, so yeah, the Hero of the Day, uh, St. Anger, again, they've been playing a lot of St. Anger recently, and I think Frantic and St. Anger, you know, when people hate St. Anger, those two are the less two hated songs. I love St. Anger, by the way. Um, so yeah, and last but not least, again, this isn't the order of the set list, is Fuel, just because, I don't know. I don't know. Just because fuel. Give it to me. Give me fuel. Give me fire. Give me chicken and salad on the side. Uh, so yeah, that those are my prediction. And the thing I thought of is they play Seek and Destroy a lot in the encore. So maybe that. Probably battery, most likely. Um, so yeah, those are my predictions. What are your predictions? How stupid are my predictions? What do you hope they play? Are you going to see, are you going to the concert? Are you one of the lucky few? Well, not few, there's probably thousands. Are you one of the lucky people going to SNM 2? Are you gonna see the movie in theaters? I might. Uh, so yeah, this Friday, it they're doing it. And uh, I hope it's awesome. I hope they don't just rehash it. That would suck. Uh, so yeah, what do you think of the whole thing? What are, what are your thoughts? What are your thoughts on the video? Let me know. Uh, this Friday, I'm doing, uh, or fr Friday, uh, this Thursday is Not or Shake It Chapter 2. Don't miss it. Uh, hopefully it's going to be good. I don't know. So yeah, are you excited for It Chapter 2? I am. All right, that's the video. Uh, thanks for tuning in. Thanks for liking, if you like it. Uh, please subscribe, like, comment. I want to know your thoughts. And uh, yeah, that's it. Thanks for cringing. Goodbye.